Hey man, say man, what's good YouTube, bro? As you guys can see by the title and the thumbnail, this is another fashion video. So, for today's video, bro, I won't be talking too much, bro. I'll just shoot straight into it. Like the video, comment down below what you guys do want to see next. And sub to the channel if you guys are new. I appreciate the views I'm getting, bro. I'm telling y'all, this is much love. We ain't, you feel me, there yet, but we there a little bit, man. I can just see the progress. But, I will be rating you guys clothing brand. I got a couple clothing brands in hand that I will be showing you guys on camera and just give y'all my honest opinion. If y'all know me, bro, y'all know I'm giving my honest opinion. Hey, if you feel upset or anything about that, don't send me nothing that you know, you feel me, isn't, you know, right. But, if you got some hard pieces, bro, check me on Instagram down below or um in the description below to have my Instagram in the box, bro. Just go hit me up on there. You don't have to follow me, but if you want to, you can. And also, just let me know if you want to send your piece to me, and I'll give you the information. But, let's get into the video. Let's do it. Alright, y'all. So, for the first piece, also, we have three pieces. We have more than three, but I want to give y'all three pieces just so y'all can know, like, I wasn't lying about, you feel me, the clothing brands. And also, I have two of the same pieces, but the shirts are different. It's an oversized tee, and the other, well, it's an oversized crop tee, and the other one is just a crop tee. And, uh, yeah, so we're going to get into the first shirt, bro. The first shirt will be this Trap House Island hoodie. I mean, not hoodie, but this Trap House Island um, T-shirt right here, bro. As you guys can see, it's T-H-I in the middle of it with a star. You feel me? And then I'm going to show you all the back of it. Hold on, let me get the shirt right. But, but it says, do not arrest this person. You feel me? If you guys can't see that, it'd probably be backwards, but that's what it says. But... Just the material of the, you feel me? As you guys can see, bro, the collar is, you feel me, pretty thick. Um, and the acid wash great is tough as well. You feel me? Shirt overall is tough. The screen printing is tough as well. Um, you feel me? When only thing is when I stretch it, you know, it cracks. But that's really about it. Only thing I say on that is just keep screen printing in the right you know, spot so it wouldn't crack because as time go on and you wash these clothes, you feel me? Something is going to, you know, turn out bad if you don't do it to perfection, whether if you're making them on hand, I mean, if you make them by yourself or if you got you a manufacturer to do it as well. But this is the front of the t-shirt, bro. I will get this an 8 out of 10 just because of the colorway and also the design. I feel like the design on the back is actually, you feel me, eye-catching just because this damn time, bro, I mean, we all can't lie, it's in our faces. Um, African American brutality is still going on, bro, as far as 2024. So, I feel like personally, this piece right here will, you feel me, go along with that. And then, I mean, do not arrest this person, bro, especially, you feel me, that saying is actually eye catching as heck, especially if, you feel me, you walk in and somebody's looking at the back of your shirt. Or, you feel me, you're just out in public with a shirt on and you're African American, and this shirt is, you know, it's not just for African Americans, but you get the point of what I'm saying. So, this is an eye-catching shirt, bro. I'm not going to cap. The owner of this tee definitely did the right thing on making this shirt. And, um, yeah, bro. Let me know what y'all think in the comments below on these ratings, on what the, what y'all think the uh, ratings of these tees should be. But, yeah, let's get into the next shirt, and let's do it. All right, man. So, for the next piece we have, let me put my phone up. For the next piece we have will be this Trap House Island. You feel me? Same thing, but it's an oversized crop tee. And this is, you can tell it's an oversized shirt, but this is the shirt, bro. Same thing on the front. Only thing I can say is this one here is actually on the front and the other one was like kind of downward some. So make sure your pieces actually, you know, match up with everything and make sure it all looks the same. Because if one person get a shirt and it's in different, you know, cate not category, it's in a different spot and somebody else has have a shirt and they act, they, and they logo is in a different spot as well, they gonna, you know, look like, dang, what's going on? But, yeah, bro, um, also the access paint. Make sure y'all guys, you feel me, don't have access paint on y'all design. You feel me? Just because, bro, like I say, people actually wear this stuff out. And when we, with us wearing this stuff out, bro, just make sure it's all to perfection. All that other stuff, bro. This is the back of the tee. As you guys can see on this one, it fades away. I'm not sure if the shirt is made like this or not, but this is actually tough. And as you guys can see, the crap look at the bottom of it with the distressed look as well. And you also got the sleeves distressed too. I get this one a 6 out of 10 just because of all the access paint that's on it. You feel me? And then also on the front as well. And like I said, bro, I'm just being honest with y'all brand. So you feel me? 
what y'all sent me and what y'all, you know, what y'all sent me is what y'all get, the type of results y'all get. But I'm not going to lie, like I said, this clothing brand piece is a, you know, a nice design. Also, the material is hella cotton. But, I mean, as you progress, you feel me, the progression goes up a little bit more, well, a lot more. But that's that. Like I say, for this trap house tee, just make sure that the uh, material and the paint is, you know, in the right spot and also not too much everywhere. You feel me? Just because, like I say, everybody, everybody will be wearing this and people's shirts don't want to look different. But as time go on, you will get a manufacturer, hopefully. So, you feel me? You won't have to worry about it. But that's this piece, bro. And let's get into the last clothing brand I have to show y'all. And let's do it. All right, man. So for the last clothing brand we have will be this shirt called Altered Emotions. This shirt is hard as heck to me just because not even, it's just the face, bro. Like, the face is tough. This is a cropped oversized tee as well. And I will be posting pictures on my Instagram today. Well, not today because this video will be out in two days. But on the... On the 5th of March is when the pictures will be out. But, yeah, bro, this shirt is tough. Like I say, all the names will be in the description below. This shirt is called Altered Emotions. It's on Instagram. And also, you feel me, y'all can go follow the uh, the actual brand owner, you feel me, just to give some words to him and ask some information about the t-shirt and all that stuff. But, yeah, bro, Altered Emotions. Like I said, I like the shirt a lot just because... You feel me? Not just the face, but the background as well. And also, bro, this is all hand-painted, so give this man some credit because not a lot of people that's out there doing hand-painted, you feel me, stuff, especially like this. This is like some Atlanta-type drip, but I didn't get this. This dude stay in Dallas, Texas, and I got the shirt from him, so shout-out to him, bro. Keep doing your thing, and I wish all you clothing brand owners the best. If I don't have your piece or if I do, whether if I put it in a video or not, bro, I wish all you guys success, bro, on y'all clothing brand journey. And also, you feel me? Just get y'all some, get y'all money on for this stuff, bro. Because not a lot of people taking this type of stuff serious. And for the ones who don't take it serious, you feel me? Just, you feel me? Lock in, bro. You never know how far this stuff can get you. But, all to the emotions, bro. Oversized crop hoodie. I mean, oversized crop t-shirt. Um, only thing I can say on your jump, bro, is make sure that you're, uh... You get you some tags. I'm not saying right now, but like later on, you feel me, as your clothing brand increases and go a lot more up, make sure you get you your own uh, clothing brand tag just so, you feel me, people won't bite off your style. And what I mean by bite off your style is go to where you go to get your shirts from and, you feel me, they try to go there and get the little hookup and stuff. So, yeah, that's really about it, bro. This shirt is tough. I get this a nine, a 8 out of 10, honestly, bro, just because of your... um. The up here, bro. But this shirt is not doing too much at all. And it's also just not simple. You guys can wear a pair of Air Force One with this. And probably can even slick on some Jordans if it's black and white. But like I said, bro, these are the clothing brands that I decided to rate. If you guys have a clothing brand, bro, just hit my DMs. My Instagram will be in the description below. And it also pop up on the screen a few times or probably a one time or something. That, bro, Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it wasn't too long, but also too short as well. I love y'all, bro. Um, Keep running up the videos. You feel me? Um, Keep subscribing, bro. Like I said, y'all do not have to, so with y'all just subscribing to my channel, you feel me? Even if we getting like three subscribers a day, you feel me? It still doesn't matter. I just thank God and also thank y'all for subscribing to me. And also the ones who just watching my videos, I appreciate y'all as well. If you guys want to see y'all close the brand to me, bro, just go follow my Instagram down below because I don't have a P.O. box right now. So I will be letting y'all know where to ship y'all, you feel me, clothing brands to for me to get them. Um, I hope you guys like this video. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are new and if you ain't sub yet, what are you doing? Also, comment down below what you guys want to see next or if y'all bump with this video and want a part two, let me know. Um, that'll be the end of this video, bro. DLN4L. We out.